today I'm going to show you how to hang a bicycle. Great way to store it where it's out of the way and where it's not going to get damaged. The first thing you need to do is find a nice place that you're going to be able to store it. And I'm going to choose this wall. Over here we've got the tools that I'm going to be using today. So we've got our personal protective equipment, our glasses, and earmuffs. We've got our drill, our hammer drill, and our impact driver. We've also got screws, spaghetti, our pencil for marking, and of course our brackets for hanging up our bicycle. So, take my bike bracket and measure it up where I want it on the wall. Our next step is going to be drilling into the brick. Little handy tip is if you're going into any material and you don't want your drill going too far in, take a little bit of electrical tape like this, measure out how far in you want your drill bit to go and then wrap the tape just around the bottom and that way it'll stop your drill bit going too far in. Make sure you put on your personal protective equipment and plug in your hammer drill. Once we've drilled our holes, we just need to take some spaghetti, push it into the holes. The spaghetti provides something for the screws to bite into so that they can hold your bracket to the wall. Next thing we're going to be doing is taking our impact driver, our screws and our bracket. We're going to be screwing the bracket to the wall. Now that that's done, make sure that your bracket is secured to the wall, then you can just hang your bike up. Easy as that. If you've got any kids' bikes lying around, a really simple idea is to grab a bracket and attach it into a rafter. I'll show you how to do that now. Grab your drill, suitable drill bit, find a good spot. Next, just take your bracket and you should be able to just use your hands to screw this in all the way. The further it's screwed in, the more stable it'll be. And now that's attached. Next thing, just need to grab your bike and hang it up. This sort of hook is excellent for kids' bikes. For more great how-tos, feel free to visit our website.